forget the northern lights, we could create aurora anywhere, particle accelerator could one day make man-made shows in our atmosphere. Scientists in California described how to create artificial auroras on Earth. They said a particle accelerator could be sent 185 miles up into space. It would then fire high energy beams back at Earth's atmosphere. This would create auroras to study and even types of lightning. When high energy electrons and ions from the sun hit Earth's upper atmosphere, they can excite atoms and create fantastic colors, which we see on the ground as auroras. And now a study has claimed that we could create our own auroras by firing a particle accelerator into the sky from space. The intriguing research says that a beam fired from the machine would create artificial auroras and it could even create lightning in the atmosphere. The accelerator would be located in space, 185 miles, 300 kilometers, above the ground, and would fire back towards Earth's atmosphere. What is an aurora? There are two types of auroras on Earth, the aurora borealis in the northern hemisphere, known as the Northern Lights, and the Aurora Australis in the Southern Hemisphere, known as the Southern Lights. Auroras occur when highly charged electrons from the solar wind collide with atoms of oxygen and nitrogen in the Earth's atmosphere at altitudes from 20 to 200 miles, 32 to 320 kilometers, above the planet's surface. The interactions between the charged particles give off light. Auroral displays appear in many colors, red, yellow, green, blue, and violet. The color of the aurora depends on which atom is struck and the altitude of the meeting. The common green hue is caused by colliding oxygen molecules at altitudes of up to 150 miles, 240 kilometers. It would be based on an instrument called the Compact Particle Accelerator for Space Science, COMPASS which is being developed by the SLAC National Accelerator Laboratory and SRI International, both in California. The authors say that employing such instrumentation would offer many scientific opportunities to study the behavior of particles in the upper atmosphere, wrote Mr. Zastrow. The paths of the electrons would trace out the arcing field lines of Earth's magnetic field, illustrating how they bend and snap during the intense geomagnetic activity caused by solar storms. As they descend into the Earth's atmosphere, some of the electrons would strike atmospheric molecules, producing visible aurora-like emission. He added that the beam might even be able to trigger different forms of light. Please subscribe to us on YouTube, Facebook and Twitter. You can visit us on www.therealthingmean.webs.com.